1973, a shy young woman from Minnesota applied to all 18 existing veterinary medical colleges in the United States. And I was rejected by 17 of them. <laughs> because in 1973, if you had a veterinary school in your state of residence, that was essentially your only choice. At the time, I had no awareness and no understanding of the significance that AAVMC played in the quality of my education or the amazing professional opportunities I would have because of that education. However, my organizational experiences over the years have taught me a great deal about AAVMC. So I am especially proud, I'm especially grateful, and I'm especially excited to offer congratulations to you tonight from the World Veterinary Association, speaking for a half a million veterinarians around the world for your 50 years of public service. <laughs> 